A lot of police detractors will talk really big about how badges don't grant extra rights. And they're right, badges don't grant extra rights. They take them away. So we're going to go over that right now. We're going to start right with the First Amendment, the one everybody talks about the most, free speech. And people think that their free speech is really hampered by the private organization that they work for. Hey, come work for the government. You think free speech is a thing that you don't have or you're being downtrodden on because, you know, McDonald's tells you you can't say things when you're at work? Man, free speech goes out the window if you're a cop. It goes right out the window. All this, if I put something on Facebook, and I know people who have been punished for things that they put on Facebook, about the agency, about police work, about whatever. You put something silly on Facebook, all of a sudden you're losing your job, you're getting suspended, all sorts of problems, right? The right to bear arms. Here's one that we get all the time. As much as people that lean to the left talk about free speech, people that lean to the right complain about cops and the right to bear arms, right? Well, let me let you in on a little secret. You see, police departments are exempt from a lot of gun laws. Cops aren't exempt for as many as you think. We have HR 218, which allows concealed carry of handguns as long as the department says we can. And that's another little, little tidbit. As long as the department says we can, all over the country. And a lot of people are really envious of, that, envious of that. And for good reason. That is a nice little perk. The problem is we're not exempt from all of them. And in fact, some gun laws are more restrictive for us because we're police officers. How could that be, you say? Well, because my department can write policy. And that policy can affect me even when I'm off duty. So where Joe Schmo can go get a carry permit, and most states have carry permits or their constitutional carry these days, Joe Schmoke go carry, carry permit and he can carry whatever he wants, however he wants. That's where you get people who just take a high point pistol, shove it in their waistband. They like HK, they carry HK. They like Glock, they carry Glock. As a police officer, I don't have that option. In fact, my agency can tell me when, where, how, and why I can carry a gun and what I can use it from. They very strictly regulate the use of firearms for me, for my profession. Where the average person is only restricted by what the law says for the general public, I have additional restrictions because I'm a police officer and under the law and additional restrictions by my agency. In fact, there are some police officers on the north side of Chicago work for towns that say you can't carry when you're off duty for X number of years. Now there are some of those guys, they get carry permits, right? They get carry permits and they think, well, I'm carrying under my carry permit. Eh, wrong answer. Department tells you you can't carry when you're off duty. You just don't get to carry when you're off duty. Then you get fired if you do carry when you're off duty. But nope. Right to bear arms goes right out the window. No private employer would get away with doing that, but police departments, because it's a public entity, because they're held to, police officers are held to such a higher standard, they can get away with that. And judges are not gonna side with us about an agency firing us because we broke rules, even if we're not working. Moving right along there, search and seizure. So you work for Hot Topic or Walmart or whatever, right? There was a certain instance, a certain set of circumstances where you start having privacy rights, right? If you bring your backpack to work, work might say, well, we have the right to search that backpack. You'd be like, no, you don't. No, I have an expectation of privacy in this backpack. You can say, well, I have an expectation of privacy in my pocket. Your work can't just search you just to search you. Hey, guess what? Welcome to police work. They just get to search me whenever they want to. Now they don't because I don't do any weird shenanigans that would lead them to do that, but they can search me. I don't have any expectation of privacy. The courts have come down repeatedly. Police officers have no expectation of privacy at all. And so my employer can just search me. No one's gonna say anything about it. And then anything they find, they can use a criminal case against me. Self-incrimination. You wanna talk about a biggie. As a private person, most people, they don't have to, they don't have to incriminate themselves. They just like, well, I'm not gonna talk, right? Try doing that as a cop, right? The big, Example people give when they're talking about concealed carry classes is like, hey, if it's sketchy at all, don't talk to them, don't say anything until you get your attorney there, right? You try doing that as a police officer, you're gonna find yourself without a job and very likely incarcerated. We don't have the same protections that the general public does. See, if I get into something, I have to report to my employer, my employer that is the government, and they can then hold that statement against me in a court of law. That's just the way it is. There's never been a judge that's come down on the other side of that saying, well, no, 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 you violated his rights against self-incrimination for something that he did. Mm -mm. Not the way it works. So, yeah, they're right. Badges don't grant extra rights. They take a whole boatload of them away. And they're mainly rights that people take for granted because they live in the United States and they're used to having these rights. So, something to ponder. Till next week, you guys be safe. Take care of each other.
I'd like to thank all the Patreon supporters, and especially the Shift Supervisor level Patreon supporters that we have listed here. Your contributions are what allows free field training to continue on and become better. Thank you.